All right, so guys, these two games are nine years apart. Let's go to the video. So I'm guessing this is uh, Suicide Squad and uh, Batman Arkham, right? I think I've seen a thumbnail of this. And um, I'm going to keep it real with you. Based off the thumbnail, they look completely different. Obviously, they're made by the same company. Oh, my God, man. This game was ahead of its time. I don't care what people say. This was ahead of its time, bro. I think it, listen, in my personal opinion, the Spider-Man games are absolutely amazing, bro. But, bro, oh my god. The Batman Arkham games, if you guys don't know, the one on the left is the Batman Arkham games. The one on the right is the Suicide Squad Kid of Justice League. It's honestly crazy, bro, on how that game, the one on the left, came out nearly 10 years ago. That's crazy. That's honestly crazy, bro. That is crazy, bro. Honestly. Made by the same company, too, bro. Look at this, bro. Oh, my goodness gracious. Listen, as I was saying before, in my personal opinion, I think that the uh, that the Batman Arkham series is the best superhero series, like superhero video game series ever, in my opinion. Look at, oh my goodness, Grace. Look at this. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Honestly, bro. That is, oh my goodness, Grace. This game came out like 10 years ago. Y'all, look at, bro, look at Batman's like cape, bro. Look at Batman's cape. Do y'all see his cape? Like, I'm not even, like, gassing this up. This... And let's not forget, like, Harley Quinn literally killed, like, our Batman. Let's, not, like, let's never forget that. I hope, like, you know, that was part of, like, some, like, different universe type of thing. I hope that's not actually true. Like, like I'm, I'm still in denial right now. Like, this man, Batman, was taking on, bro. They were. <sighs> this man, Batman, was taking on thirty guys a night like LeBron. This man, Batman, was 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 dropping forty like LeBron every single night, and he lost to Harley Quinn. He lost to this. Our boy lost to this. She has one motion. She has one motion. She's doing the Hulk smash. And he lost to this? Listen, I'm sorry. Listen, Rocksteady, I, I don't know. Listen. This gotta be a lie. Like, <laughs> this gotta be a... Bro, even... Bro, even the old school Harley Quinn's going crazy. The old school Harley Quinn... Bro... Bro, the old school Harley Quinn was going ridiculous, bro. And then people talking about some... Oh, well, Harley Quinn, you know, she... You know, she deserves it, you know. Uh, cause Batman... You know, cause Joker. You know, as revenge for Joker. What? Bro, even the old Harley Quinn was going crazy, bro. Oh my god. Man, she was swinging that bat like Barry Bonds. <laughs> Ooh. See, I forgot about her combos. Oh, we're looking at the, uh, looking at the water physics. I mean, their water physics are, they're, like, they're good. Like, I never really... Dang, they do get better water physics. Wait, this was made by the... This was made by Rocksteady, right? Am I wrong? This was made by Rocksteady, right? So why couldn't they use, like, the same elements as they did with... I mean, obviously, you know, they added more color and stuff like that to, like... To, like, the Suicide Squad game, but, like... It's a Suicide Squad game, though. It's supposed to be, like, dark and, like, 
like I understand what they did for like the for like the Batman games. They made it very dark and like gremlin like because obviously it's Batman. But like they should have at least like you know I I don't know, bro. I don't know. Like whenever it comes to like like the hardcore like you know uh, graphics and details stuff like that, I'm not really a nerd for that. Like I just like say it like how it is like, like in my own language or whatever. Like I I can't really speak in like nerd languages, but look at Batman, bro. Look at his suit, bro. Look how bulky he was too. Oh my goodness, bro. Of man, man. Hope you guys enjoyed this, my, my reaction to this, man. I can't believe these games um, are almost ten years apart, man. And, and in my opinion, bro, I, I, like I would take Batman, like the whole Batman Arkham series, over any superhero game. I, I listen the the Spider Man series, absolutely amazing, bro. Z tier, the Batman Arkham series, bro. I'm gonna be honest, bro. Z tier too, bro. I, I'm gonna be honest, bro. S tier, to be honest. Uh, th this is the greatest superhero um game trilogy ever i think that every single game uh arkham city arkham knight arkham asylum hit different i think there was one more but i don't think i played the uh the, there was like a fourth one i think i don't think i played that one um but yeah all three games bro perfect bro perfect the fighting style the graphics everything was absolutely perfect the spider-man games are perfect as well bro like i'm not trying to like dumb down like the spider-man games they were really good too but i just think that the batman arkham series is the best superhero series uh, best superhero video game series ever, like of all time. I think that's the best like version of like uh, like in video games that we have seen in like like whenever it comes to like superhero games, bro. Because like there's nothing that came close to it. And obviously the Suicide Squad game. I I mean I respect their story. It's just at the end of the day, it comes nowhere near what we expected because um you know it when you have a superhero game, bro. Um and I understand like you know. And people would be like, well, it's not a, technically, it's not a superhero game. We're controlling the, we're, we're trying to kill the, like, bro, like, <laughs> you're trying to be, you're trying to be so, like, specific and everything like that. Listen, it's still a superhero game. You still have the, you still have Batman, Superman, Wonder Woman, you still have Harley Quinn and, 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 and all these, oh, and, and, and the rest of her goonies, too, yeah. Like, let, let's not ignore that, okay? It is a superhero game, and we've all expected we didn't really expect it to be like bat like the like the Batman Arkham series or like Spider Man or whatever, but we expected it to be good, you know. And um, I I understand like why a lot of people didn't like it. Um, I don't know. I just felt like for me the combat was definitely off. Um, I feel like they were trying to like do too much whenever it came to like the combat. Like I think for me the most unusable person for me is probably Deadshot. I think he has to like he has like the little jetpack thing going, so he has to like glide and try to do this. You gotta hold this button, hold this button to make him go over here. Then you gotta um, pull out the gun to snipe, whatever. Da, 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 da. It's, it's just, I get it. It's a part of his character. You're supposed to sni like snipe, shoot the gun, whatever. But like I like, that's not really what I'm used to. So um, Deadshot was basically unusable to me. Um, I'll probably say the most usable person for me, um, King Shark, bro. King Shark was definitely the most fun character to use. Because, bro, you could just launch him up. And he could just drop down, bro. Like Winston, bro. In Overwatch or something like that, bro. For real, you could just launch him up. He could just drop down, whatever. And he was kind of like, like the um, like the brawler type, you know, if, if that makes sense. But other than that, the Suicide Squad Kid of Justice League, I'm going to be honest with you. Like, the story was 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 good. But the gameplay wasn't so good uh, for me. I'm going to just... You know, I'm just keeping an eye on this. Other than that, see you guys later for the next one. I'm out. Comment down below, man. What do you guys think about Suicide Squad? Kid of Justice League, like your honest opinion about it. And I'll see you guys later for the next one. I'm out. And bye.